Milling is often used following the granulation stages to break down lumps or agglomerates, giving a more uniform granule size. This can be wet milling, directly after the mixer granulator and before the dryer, or dry milling, directly after the dryer. Finally, in this section, we will briefly look at dry granulation. Here, granules are formed without using a liquid solution. This is used when the product is sensitive to moisture and heat. Forming granules without moisture requires compacting and densifying of the powders. This is conducted on a roller compactor sometimes referred to as a chilsonator. Material feed rates are critical in this process. Typically, the roller compactor uses two screw feeders or agitators in series to consistently deliver powder uniformly between two pressure rollers. The powders are compacted into a ribbon or small pellets between these rollers and then milled to the required granule size for compression. 